this continues on with you. This yes, is crazy. I am. This uh, is crazy. I, I really am, Ashley. I, I'll tell you what. I'm a coach on the Pittsburgh Steelers coaching staff. I'm very concerned about the opening game. Believe me. Carl Nassib and aliens? Straight up, aliens are for real. Telling everybody about it. What do you think? I, I agree. You do? Oh, I agree. I've seen one in broad daylight, and I've seen one at night. And let me tell you, we don't have the biggest difference between a UFO and our aircraft. UFOs make no noise. I think the government has hidden things uh, from us for, for decades. This is what Carl was I, saying. I, I think they've hidden friend. things from the public for decades, and I think all governments around the world have done so. When I was out in Camp Pendleton in San Diego, got drunk with guys from Area 51, and <laughs> Bruce, it, I'm I telling know. you, you wouldn't come out your house for for years. Aliens, a big topic today in the show. This is fantastic. The Buckeyes are still a huge 37 and a half point favorite. Buckeyes are loaded on both sides of the ball again, Mark. Bottom line, a lot of distractions have been going on here. I don't think they're gonna be fully focused for this game. Oregon State's not much. They're the cellar dwellers in the Pac-12. They'll probably get beat to a pulp in this game. Not really panic just yet when it comes to him getting back, hopefully. But, you know, is there not a little panic? I, I, I don't like to use the word panic either, Ash, sure. but you know what? We've got a couple of days until this uh, second deadline with guys clearing waivers. Will this cause a little bit of urgency in the Indians front office to grab another relief pitcher just for insurance purposes? I think it should anyways. I mean, you never know. We have no idea what could happen regardless. And we talked about Cody Allen and not knowing what would happen in that sense. So I think in insurance would be good in this case, of course. As much as we used him in the playoffs and the World Series a couple of years ago, remember this. The following spring was the World Baseball Classic, and Miller represented his country in that. A lot of pride. Don't blame him at all. I blame Major League Baseball. I would discontinue that, and it's precisely because of pitchers that I would discontinue. It's just Rob Burlikamp says, it doesn't matter how you juggle the pitching staff. If anyone thinks we can go to the World Series with the staff, you better think again. It's not going to happen. We need help on the mound. Well, that's a stupid yeah. comment, considering we have one of the best pitching staffs in all of Major League Baseball. We went from having the second worst bullpen to arguably one of the top five. That's a fact. And our starting rotation is one of the top three in all of Major League Baseball. So you're an idiot.